California Penal Code. Today we're going to do um, 863, 864, and 865. And what these pertain to are commitment for examination. So 863 says form of commitment. The commitment for examination made by an endorsement signed by the magistrate on the warrant of arrest to the following effect, quote, the within named AB having been brought before me under this warrant is committed for examination to the sheriff of blank, end quote. If the sheriff is not present, the defendant may be committed to the custody of a peace officer. 864, reading of depositions. At the examination, the magistrate must first read to the defendant the depositions of the witnesses examined on taking an information. Remember, an information is a charge, and they're talking about the witnesses. This is all leading up to a probable cause hearing, and were you there? 865 says, examination of witnesses in presence of defendant and cross-examination. Examination of witnesses to be in the presence of defendant, etc. The witnesses must be examined in the presence of the defendant and may be cross-examined on his behalf. So again, they're, they're supposed to take this ticket, go before a magistrate, and have a probable cause hearing of which you're supposed to be there, and then you're supposed to be able to hear who says what, and you're supposed to be able to cross-examine and give you a rebuttal. Have you seen any of this happen on a ticket? If you want to know what this means, or understand how you're supposed to use it, or how to put it together in a defense or an attack against the prosecution, you got to go to our site, CaliforniaTicketBusters.com, and learn the secrets on how to put this recipe together for a surefire win.